Nice fish. Nice! Circle hooks. Oh. Yellow tail collar. It's going in. What's going on, guys? As you guys saw, it is 1.48 a.m. And I'm gonna be heading out, going deep sea fishing again on the boat. We're gonna be heading down through Coronado Islands, checking out Coronado Islands, and then headed further south. And we'll see what we get. I'm not exactly sure, but our main uh, target is tuna first, and then we'll see what we get after that. So, let's go. So my setup was 35 pound mainline going down to a ringed two op gamagatsu circle hook and I had a sliding uh, small weight on there to get my sardine down and I would either hook my sardine through the belly or through the nose. The belly would help it get away from the boat and go down but it seemed that it stayed on better when you hooked it through the nose. My dad was using a live sardine with a little bit of a heavier weight and he hooked up first. Yeah. Oh good. Nice dad. I'm kind of right next to you, so I'm gonna get out of the way. Yeah. Yeah, I'm coming. Let me get out of your way. Oh, nice. Yellow. Nice, yellow. Pull towards you. Okay. You know I mean? He's not done. He's not done. Oh! oh. Yeah. Coming towards me. Oh, wow. This is, he's in the kelp, I think. Nice fish. Nice fish. I want to put this big old smell on there. Alright. Wow, he's bring taking a in nice now. run. Wait for the ring to the I don't know, he's kind of being dead weight right now. There he goes. He tried to run. Come on, baby. Here he comes. Nice. Yeah. Nice. nice. Gaff. Gaff right through the... Oh. In the back. Let's go. Let's go. I had a, one of those ring circle hooks. Oh, shoot. rough. <laughs> yeah, let's go. This one's mine. Oh my gosh. Blood on the decks. Watch There's mine. So everyone, I just made it back to the ramp and 
it was a pretty good day. Three yellowtail. I, I, I uh, caught one and then my dad and his friend caught the rest and the other two, yeah, so I called a success. Let's go cook him. So everyone, it's a few days later and last night we cooked up a lot of yellowtail, including two collars, but today I'm gonna be cooking up one yellowtail collar. Nice piece of meat right there. I've only had yellowtail collar twice, once last night and then once at a restaurant and they were both delicious. But today I'm gonna cook it a little bit differently and we'll see how it turns out. So I wanna keep this really simple. I'm only gonna season it with, I'm gonna rub a little olive oil on it and then I'm gonna just gonna put salt, pepper, and garlic powder. That's it. And then I'm really gonna let the fattiness of the collars and the best, this, this is really, I think, the best part of the yellowtail. I'm gonna let the flavor come out by itself. I don't need to add a bunch of seasoning. So let's get to seasoning. I'm just gonna add a little salt first. A little seasoning of pepper there. I'm gonna add a little garlic powder. And then I'm gonna rub just a little bit of olive oil on it. And then I'm also gonna put a little in the pan, so. Yellowtail collar, it's going in. done cooking guys looks super good it's, it's really meaty look at that there's a bunch of big bones in the collar and you can just suck the meat right off so let's give it a try first bite this is a nice bone right here I'm gonna suck the meat off it's so oily and fatty if you guys ever catch a yellowtail don't throw the collars, it's the best part. So guys, I finished up that yellowtail collar. It was super good. One of the best, it's one of my favorite out of all the fish, the yellowtail, and especially the collars. And yeah, that's gonna be it for this video, guys. Drop a like if you guys enjoy the yellowtail videos, we'll do more. And drop a comment below, any questions, ideas, anything you guys have. And Thank you guys for the support and I'll see you guys in the next video.